Uh, I am Gerardo Sánchez. Uh, I am a technical officer in environmental sustainable health systems here at the WHO office in Bonn. I am an environmental scientist, a public health specialist and an economist by training. Health systems are crucial in protecting communities from environmental health risks. At the same time, they represent a very large sector of the economy. They are about 9% of GDP here in the WHO region of Europe. Um, they also employ a very large health workforce, about 17 million people. And of course, uh, with this size and its operations, uh, they represent significant impacts on the environment. They produce large uh, streams of waste, wastewater and greenhouse gas emissions and other types of pollution as well. Those have to be addressed and typically they have been addressed by health systems in the region through compliance with environmental regulations. However, many providers have gone beyond compliance and they have incorporated environmental sustainability into their core functions. And while doing so, they have realized that there are large benefits to be had from sustainability for patients, for providers, for health systems themselves, and also for the environment. WHO has been collecting evidence on the benefits of environmental sustainability for health systems already for over five years. We have looked at very many areas. We have looked at environmentally preferable purchasing and procurement. We have looked at energy efficiency, uh, healthcare waste management, wastewater treatment, and so on and so forth. And we have come to the conclusion that there are many areas in which the benefits are very clear and the investments are, will provide soundly a very good cost effectiveness or cost benefit. Uh, one of the important things to keep in mind about the environmental sustainability of health systems is that most of the activities and interventions that we have seen have been so far pushed and driven by providers in a bottom-up fashion. However, those interventions and activities, they are not enough for the system-wide changes that we need to see. What we need to see is a top-down, governance-driven effort towards environmental sustainability and the overall sustainability of health systems. That's why what I'd like to see out of the conference is a strong and explicit commitment to first measure and then improve the environmental sustainability of health systems themselves.